When I was a kid, I was always playing in the dirt. In fact, I got in big trouble several times by trying to dig to China in my backyard. <laughs> my father, uh, of course, was not very supportive. My mother was really not supportive because I was often, would often come home with uh, dirt on my clothes or, or you know, muddy knees and shoes. But I always really enjoyed playing outside in the dirt in my sandbox. I had no idea that there would be a profession that you can actually be a soil scientist and essentially play in the dirt. I'm Janice Bettinger. I'm a professor of soil science at Utah State University in the Department of Plant, Soils, and Climate. I'm a soil scientist, which means I study soil, and the kind of soil scientist I am is a pedologist. I study landscape evolution and soil formation, which allows us to predict the distribution of soils on the landscape and make maps, what we call soil survey. A good day for me is every day. I love what I do. A great day for me is to come out in the field on a day like today, where I can, can be outside, I can look at the landscape, I can look at the soils, and I can be challenged by the relationships between the landscape and the soil and trying to figure out how all this stuff got here. Another great day for me is to interact with students. I just love taking people out in the field with me and getting them to see how slopes and landforms and soils all relate. So what we do in our classes, in fact, I do this every week in the soil genesis class that I teach in the fall semester, is we come out to places like this where we've excavated a pit and exposed the soil. Now what we'll look at is the fact that we're on this gravelly deposit that was deposited by a stream that was coming out of Green Canyon, but the stream was coming out of Green Canyon when Pleistocene Pluvial Lake Bonneville was here. I'm sure you've all heard about Lake Bonneville, how it was here about 10,000 or more years ago. It filled Cache Valley, basically it was over my head by 100 feet or more. Well, soil is everywhere. Even if it's been covered by concrete, soil is there. And soil, it underlies everything that we do. So to be a soil scientist, okay, there are many different kinds of soil scientists, but to do the kind of work that I do, it helps to be curious, it helps to enjoy being outside. Obviously, sometimes you end up digging holes. A lot of times we work in wilderness areas or in roadless areas and we have to go in and excavate the soil by hand. So if you like hard work, you, you like to be outside, uh, you like puzzles, you like figuring out things, um, those are all things that would probably help you in this discipline or if you like those kind of things, this is probably something that you should consider.